What's up everybody, it's me, your boy, the Fluffy Gamer, the round one. And I got this guy with me again. We are headed to LA for the SoCal. I knew that Wrong. was Wrong, it's not LA, we're going to City of Industry. Oh, City of Industry, to Frankenstein's to go check out the SoCal Retro Expo. It's Sunday. So hopefully there's still a lot of good stuff over there. It's not happening. No? No. All right, fuck it. We're going home. I uh, tricked you. We're actually going to a gay porn shoot. Oh, sweet. Yeah. All right. See you guys over in the city of industry. Come join me on my adventures to find retro games. Will I strike gold? Well, I strike out. Only one way to find out. He's big. And he's fluffy. Now let's start the show. Alright guys, we made it to Frank and Sons. And it's packed. Let's go inside. And check it out. Everybody, OGP, as the shirt reads, with my man Dustin Ferguson and Fluffy Gamer back here. I'm here too. I'm here too. We are at Frank and Sons for a retro game convention Expo. today. SoCal Under Retro Expo. Gaming Expo. This is going to be fun. You guys remember Frank and Sons, that big, big warehouse, lots with of with all the Funko Pops, video games, Funko Pops, and just everything cool in here. But they're specializing in retro games today. I this hope Pat the NES really Punk bad. is going to be here. Badass. Just paid. We got our we got our badges. We got our lanyards got here. Stinking badges. We're official. We can now make our way. It's our first expo. In there. Check it out. Let's go see Pat the NES Punk. Look at all these games that I cannot afford. Oh. Need that. I need that. Oh, I really need that. Wow. I had that one. Excuse me, sir. Do you have a miracle piano? <laughs> Fuck! Fluffy gamer. How's it going? What's up, dude? It's awesome. You set that right in front of me. Give you a triple thumbs up. Oh, yeah. cool. Sweet. Yeah. Appreciate that, man. There you go. Yeah. So Have nice a good time. Yeah. I just got here, man. Well, First yeah. expo. Awesome. Well, my name's Kyle. It's good. I'll send you a message. You sure. too. Nice to meet you. Sir. Yeah, it's good to see you. There's the game and the game in his store. Oh, he's from the game Yeah. Oh, we got the Gang Chasers. Nice to meet you, Billy. How you doing? First time meeting you. I've seen you before. Yeah, I'm Fluffy Gamer. Okay. That's I'm, I'm in a I lot of your, your, your live streams. I knew your face. Yeah. Okay. What's up, man? How, How much? Doing? First expo I've ever been to. This is the first, first one you've ever been to? I'm always working, but now I'm out of a job for a couple months. How's it going, Jay? Good, good. How are you? Pretty it's good. It's a good one to come to. How much is it? 25, man. 25? Two discs, Blu-ray. Stepping up. Pink or brown? Pink or brown? Is that like, I mean, maybe you know? Well, no, it's like regular sex or animal sex. Oh, yeah, that's what I was saying. I mean, either. Depends on the girl. No, either. either, either. <laughs> Start with one, finish with the other. Depends <laughs> on the person. <laughs> like All right. Fucking women in the butt. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so, how was it being on Storage Wars? Oh, man, it's awful. I was on Storage Wars too. Oh, were you? Yeah, I also remember uh, the episode where 
big guy finds a whole bunch of games in the storage locker. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I helped him go through the locker. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. I, I uh, the shoot was really laid back. Yeah, really yeah. Quick. The producers are cool as shit. They're really rad, really nice people. Uh, I would do it again if they had some. Oh, yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah, yeah. Nice seeing you. Yeah, you too. All right, man. Yeah, take it easy. Oh, no. It's Pat. Pat the NES Punk. Let's get the hell out of here. All right, guys, well, we just left the SoCal Retro Expo. Pretty cool for being the first time I've ever gone to an expo. And uh, got to meet some cool people like the Gang Chasers, 8-Bit Eric, the Black Nerd, and the Game and His... No, no, we met the uh, Completionist. Yeah. Would have been cool to see the uh, Angry Video Game Nerd, James Rolfe. He was supposed to be here this weekend, but... um. I guess I missed him, so. We saw his booth, but his booth was empty. That's all right, that's all right. There was a guy over there selling uh, videos, but. Yeah. I picked up one item inside there, so guess we're gonna go hit up some thrift stores. Yeah. It's dark and I'm alone, but I'm at the next spot of the day. Let's see if they got any DVDs back here. Divine Madness. Short Circuit 1 and 2 sealed. Oh shit, look at that. Love those movies. Three bucks. Picked up one item inside there. Not too shabby. S -s -s Savers. This be the GameCube version. GameCube. Damn it. Got some Genesis games. Ooh. $5.99. $5.99. Oh, I wish that was the second master one. I actually don't have this though. Feels light. Does it have the manual? a nice clean copy. Ain't got it. I think it's only worth like five or six bucks. Oh. Meatballs 4? With Corey Feldman? Might have to get that. Alright, picked up a couple items, but we are going to continue this Fluffy Gamer episode tomorrow, which for you guys will be now. And just like that, it's tomorrow, but before we go hit up some thrift stores, I'm at the post office. Got to drop off a package. I sold the Funko Pop last night. The Invisible Bilbo Baggins. I got $39 for that. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go hit some thrift stores now. All right, at the first spot of the day, Goodwill. Picked up one item inside there. Not too bad. Alright, we're at the next spot of the day. The local Goodwill. These used to be out of print. Not sure if they are anymore. Ooh. I just got this in my last quick fix. All right, I actually picked up two more things inside there. A couple DVDs, three bucks a piece. Might have found these in the last quick fix video for a dollar a piece at the Poway Pond. But they're easy flippers. How to get them. All right, guys, we're at the next spot of the day. Book off. Have they lowered this one yet? 
Is it still 50? Yep. Glad I got mine for 30. What is this? Well, that looks kind of cool. 250. Just bring it. If you smell what the rock is cooking, can you smell what the rock is cooking? No. I got lost in the sea of DVDs inside there. Was in there for a while, didn't find any uh, out of print DVDs or anything, but I did pick up one video game, so it's time to head on home, show everything that I got for this week. See you guys over in the pickups. Perfect time. Excuse me, he asked about a miracle piano. What do you think? Yeah, you, got a, you got a miracle piano? Yeah. No, I don't I'm know. looking for one. But here, anyway, <laughs> this is what I was going to do. I want to come back and go back. Is that the fluffy gamer? No. Oh, it's the no. OGP. What up? <laughs> Hey, how's it going, man? I got well, we were wondering, we were like, is it fun to game? I was like, I don't yeah. think so. Yeah, it was kind of a last minute decision. I found some, I found some Star Trek encounters. What do you think oh, about that? Oh, you are officially a man. You're officially a man. You know I bought that game specifically to fucking break it and I broke it. Nice! Uh, I blew it up with a firecracker. <laughs> Hell yeah! Never buy another copy to break it more. Nice! I like that. <laughs> Excuse me, which games over here are free? I'm looking for free stuff. I'll take what you got behind you, that kiosk. I'll take that kiosk. <laughs> this thing not touching it not touching it I touched it you will think to yourself one day down the road man I remember when I was cool enough to hang out with OGP fighting the system like a two modern day rock and roll